Hey everybody, it's Pete J. Late night Friday, actually Saturday morning at this point, but uh, you know, I've been going train nuts today. Um, I did some train simulator uh, 2022 early, and uh, I did, uh, I think I did a run. Uh, I did the, the West Chicago local um, run. Uh, I did, again, we got the Birmingham Cross, the Frankfurt, Koba Lens, um, but I picked up Marius Pass, that's new. Um, I just picked that one up today, yesterday night, last night. I got the Miami West Palm Beach, um, we got New York to New Haven, and this is the racetrack Aurora to Chicago. I did the uh, West Chicago local earlier, didn't, uh, uh, I took my time. So that's why I got the check mark because I did not. I got hit with a couple of timeliness uh, penalties. So and of course the Washington to Baltimore that came with the uh, came with the game. So um, I'm not going to do one of these runs. I think though future broadcasts. What I'm going to do is I'm going to try and just do. Uh, I've done early bird. I haven't completed it yet. I haven't meddled. Um, I have been able to finish the run though. So that's why I got the check mark. Uh, Frankfurt Koblenz. I did. I achieved a bronze medal, so I'll at some point I'll come back and revisit it. But um, I did not do anything on the Marius Pass or Miami West Palm Beach, and the Miami West Palm Beach is only ten minutes. Um, I didn't do the first one on New York New Haven um, or actually the racetrack. The first one's like four difficulty. The second one's five. So I, I did do the easy one, didn't medal, but I did do that. Got a silver on Washington to Baltimore. So I think what I'll do is I'll try to get the first... Uh, I don't know. That doesn't make sense because this is a four. So if anything, I'd, I'd be working the opposite way. I'll <laughs> go to oil uh, for empties. So anyway, but tonight I thought I'd just... Before before I hit the sack, I thought I'd do a quick random one. So we got the uh, the engine we'll be using is the ES44DC BNSF plus 60 mixed freight cars. Plus 60... Ooh. I didn't mean to do that. Plus 60 mixed freight cars. That's what we had. We're going to depart from uh, Frankfurt HBF. The destination is Frankfurt Flughafen Rigobahn. It's a uh, summer cloudy snow. <laughs> summer with cloudy snow at six six o'clock. Can we do? What if we do winter with cloudy snow? Okay. So we'll confirm that, and then we're just going to go ahead and start, and uh, ultimately the quick drives are just that, they're pretty quick, um, pretty straight ahead, you're not making, don't typically don't have to make any stops, um, as you saw, it's going to be a BNSF, sounds like it's going to be an intermodal with uh, different um, mixed cargo cars, so... Um, Typically, what we'll have to do is we'll just get in and we'll have to operate the train to um, down the track to a, to a destination and then bring it to a stop. And that's what you do on the quick drives. It's a way of uh, kind of learning different uh, engines and uh, being able to do some stuff. Tricks of the trade. I had one. It was the Amtrak. I was just trying to do a quick drive, but for some reason, it kept the AWS kept going off. And even though I I would hit it almost as soon as it went off, for some reason it was still sending my my engine into shutdown. And I don't I don't know why that was. So it was a, a fairly long distance run, but um, but I was I was having you know, every couple of <laughs> it was, I wasn't going very far before it would shut me down, and then I have to kind of reset the whole thing, and then. Uh, Start over again. Um, achievement unlocked. ES44 DC BNSF. All right, here we are. And again, there's our pretty BS BNSF line. Uh, let's go down to the end. Wow, this is all the way into the station here. Got a little bit of a we're getting a little bit of lag. It's not not really as fluid as I like. Okay, so let's get back in the cab. Um, I'm going to see if I can find some interior lights. Cab lights, there we go. Alright, we got a radio happening, it looks something. Like. Yeah. I'd love to be able to turn that up if I could. Let's get the uh, 
reverse her into forward. We gotta go 10.51 kilometers. Um, Alright, we're gonna start start this baby moving here. Can I open the window? Can't open the window. Can I hear what they're saying? Can we uh, mess with any of this stuff back here? Not really, no. Oh, first of all, we gotta turn the brakes off. Hey, it must be late, right? Must be late. Okay, so we've released the brakes now. Now I think we'll see some action. Here we go, we're starting to see a little bit of movement. Headlights on here. We got our brakeman in the car with us. In the cab. Well, he's not here now. I don't know what happened to him. Um, get some wipers. I don't know. I would. I'd really love to turn up that radio to hear what. None of this is operable. Looking for wipers. Step lights. picked up a bit of a, a speeding penalty there because I was uh, looking for my wiper button, which I still haven't found yet, so. I don't think we need it on. I just wanted to get some of the... coming down. I, I do like to be in SF colors. I really do. Um, take off down here. 60 cars we got. Different types of uh, so if we go here go like this. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Again, I can hear the radio, I just can't. I would love to be able to turn that up, though. Had to. Probably get dinged for improper use, but I mean, one of the fun, one of the best parts is to hear the whistle. All right, so we're at. 50 miles per hour um, in a 60. We've got about 9 kilometers to go here. Cruise along. This again is, uh, I believe this is the uh, Frankfurt Kobolenz line. So we're using that map, but they grabbed a BNSF uh, locomotive that we have uh, as one of our scenarios. I think this might be from the Marius Pass. Um, yeah, I picked up, uh, again, I, did, I picked up the Miami to 
West uh, West Palm Beach, is it? I'm not sure. Um, and that was a bundle. So I got that, and I got the New York to New Haven run, and I got uh, three CSX engines with it, so I do have some extra engines. Um, it's very cool, very cool. Alright, so we're going to be coming up to 90. Again, with this much weight, I don't have a whole lot of... Uh, I mean, we're going to have to uh, start braking pretty early to try and get this under control. I'm also not even sure uh, look at how long that is. So I think, is that I mean there's another engine? I think it does because we got a second engine here, right? Really cool, really cool. like to see the BNS. Oh, we're speeding, speeding, 61 point. All right, there we go. So we are speeding a little bit. Like I said, with this having as much weight behind it as it does, you know, you don't really have to apply the brakes, just uh, turn the throttle down and it comes down. Although this, it really jumps up. Barely turning the uh, throttle, pushing the throttle up. And the thing takes off quick. cab. Um, I would really love to find out where the button for the wipers is. Alright, we're up to 80 now. Now up to 90. Of course, this is a, uh, this is a diesel, so it doesn't have a pentagraph on it. Good, doesn't it? I wish it was. Uh, I kind of wish it was uh, daylight, though. Really makes it. Yeah, you can really see it then. But I have the lights. Having the lights on is pretty cool. I think I'm speeding again. Try to drop down to 60. Not paying attention. There's our. The end of our train here. Get back up. Still not coming down. We need to come down a little bit quicker. All right, so this is a lot. Yeah, this would be a huge, <laughs> a huge. Uh, oh, it's, now it's dropped to 50. Yeah, so we would lose a lot of points here because I kind of was expecting it to uh, to drop a little bit quicker than it did. Finally got this off. Going to four. Action cam. We're also going to be hitting a downhill slope here in a minute. uphill first. this way. We're cresting the hill now, so we're going to probably want to come off the gas. Oh, we're going down in speed. 
here we go. So now we're starting to pick up some speed here. We'll wind up uh, turning the uh, throttle off and then just uh, riding the brake down this hill, I think. All right, here we're coming up. Yeah, we're coming up to it. So we're still climbing. 49.5. Alright, we're up to 80 now. Alright, so we're going up to 80. We're at uh, 3.57 miles though. So if anything, I think what we'll do is we'll try to keep uh, start getting the train under control a little bit. Start getting that uh, Frankfurt, all main, Flugolf, and regional. Um, let's try to get the speed going in the other direction. There we go, 58.6. We're about three miles out. Ooh! And my dot is way off. Why is my dot way off? Alright, so my. Cargo does not seem to be having a good time. I don't know what I did. Here we go. Okay, now it's coming back into the center there. Yeah, but that's, uh, that's how you can tell if your, your cargo and your or your passengers aren't doing so well as if that that little uh, dot gets out of the center. And that's the first time I've seen it actually really get out of that center there. So the uh, Speed limit right now is 110. We're only doing 63.9. We're still going up, and I'm trying to keep it. I want to get it coming down because um, again, we're going to have to have this thing under control. Keep it in the blue if we can. 62.6. Again, the more you apply brake, see it's starting to. It's, ooh, it's moving. It's moving. I don't know why it's moving so uh, so far. I can't get out because I'm in the uh, tunnel. All right, it's come back, so I'm not really sure what's happening. We're coming up on Flugoff uh, Frankfurt Almain. Flugoff and Regional Bonhoff 2, which I believe is going to be our stop. So we got to really kind of try to get this thing pulling. Dot is in the center, which is okay. I'll take that. We've only got about 19% braking. We've got no throttle. We're out to about 20, 25 miles per hour, which is okay. We're under a, uh, under a kilometer now, so we'll be getting there soon. We're moving along kind of at a slow, slow pace, but maybe we'll get it back up to about 30. I think we can. I think we can keep it controlled at about 30 miles, 30 kilometers an hour. tunnel. We got about a half a kilometer left till we uh, reach our destination of Frank Frankfurt Hall, Maine, Flugolf and Regional Bahnhof 2. All right, so we're at 49 now, so we're going to leave the throttle off. We're going to add a little bit of braking. Just get it going in the right direction. 
all this weight behind us, we definitely aren't going to be able to slam on the brake. So. Kind of give it a little bit, take it away. Give it a little bit, take it away. All right, 19 miles per hour. 23 kilometers. Pulling into the underground station here. Uh, the reality is, I'm sure this cargo train would never go anywhere close to this uh this station so we're at about 13 kilometers an hour be at about 10 9.2 we wanna we gotta still got a little ways to go i'm i'm surprised by how quickly it responds actually i kind of would expect that the uh the train like this 60 car lengths a lot of weight behind us i would think that it would it would take a little bit more to uh, respond, but it's done pretty good. We do like the BNSF. Okay, so we're at six, six kilometers. We're at 5.8 in speed. We'll bring it down a little bit more. Get off of the brake, three kilometers, 0.03. We're going to try and hit that point, that double zero, point two. 2.8 miles per hour, point one. service we're at zero we're all locked down there we are unload of course we can't unload there's no, there's no way we brought it in well done you've reached the end of this quick drive scenario Thanks for joining me. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And if you want to see more train sim stuff, stay uh, stay up with the... Uh, we Oh, we got an achievement. We unlocked the ES44DC BNSF. We are an ES44DC BNSF engineer target one of one completion. We stopped at one out of one destination. Uh, we were speeding six times. Improper horn use. I told you I had that, but I always want to, I want to at least hear the horn once, you know? Like I say, thanks for, for staying up with me. Thanks for going with uh, on the ride. Hopefully we'll see you next time. Till then, enjoy your weekend, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.